Okay, 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 okay. Now let's talk about Caitlin Clark and the USA 3-on-3 Women's Olympic Basketball Team. But before we get started, I want to thank y'all for tuning in to the Gertie Mac Show and taking y'all time to subscribe to the channel, liking and sharing my videos. I appreciate all of that. Now let's go. So the USA Women's Olympic 3-on-3 Basketball Team had their first game today for the Paris Olympics to kick off their journey to get another gold medal. But let's meet the team for the people who don't, who is not familiar with the three on three people that's on the team. So you have Sierra Burdick. She last played for Seattle Storm in 2021. She now plays in Spain. Then you have Rain Howard. She currently plays for the Atlanta Dream. And then we have the Erica Hemby. She plays for the Los Angeles Sparks. And according to the reports, she replaced her teammate Cameron Brick, who got injured during the season. Then, last but not least, you have Haley Van Litt. She is still in college. She plays for TCU Horn Frogs. Now, the way this whole three on three works. It's basically like, you remember back when you used to play 21? So it's the, whoever gets to 21 the fastest in 10 minutes, or if you don't get to, you know, 21 in 10 minutes, it's whoever, you know, has the most points. Now, the USA Basketball 3-on-3, three -three, they went to their social media page and said this about Germany before the game. They said, strap in. This gold medal defense is going to be a doozy. <laughs> yeah, we're going to get into that. And so, also check out what Sierra Burdick had to say about Germany before the game as well. Check this video out. We have a lot of history with Germany. We've played them several times. I think, I mean, Sonny and I joke that this is going to be like our 75th game against each other. We've been playing against each other for three, four years now. Jan and myself are very well acquainted with Germany and their sets and their personnel. And Jan has been doing a great job of just watching, you know, a ton of film and getting Ryan and Dierica, who may not have played against them as much, up to speed with personnel and how they like to play. Every, every team is going to be competitive and, um, uh, but you know, we, we know Germany pretty well. Well, clearly y'all didn't know them that well because Germany cooked y'all like a bocce. They came off the top turnbuckle like Macho Man and served y'all up with a ooh yeah. <laughs> but y'all underestimated Germany because that's why y'all went on that page, whoever ran that social media page, and said that the gold medal defense is going to be a doozy. Y'all thought y'all were just going to go in there and Germany was just going to roll over. But USA women's three on three lost this game according to what people are saying online is because one particular player got fried like catfish on defense we're going to get into her a little later so of course you know people are saying that why Caitlin clark didn't get a spot on this team because wnba players were allowed to be on this team it was a little mixture and they was like well Caitlin clark could have been on this team because the other players, they did pretty good. But people feel like the Haley Van Leet, she was trending today on X and all over social media because of her defense. And people saying that she is not good at all. And they also were saying that Caitlin Clark used to cook her all through college. Haley Van Leet thinks like she's just not good. Much respect to her. Keep your confidence going and all that. But. This is just what the people are saying is that she is not good at all, period. And that's why they lost this game. And people feel like if Caitlin Clark couldn't be on Sherry Reed Team USA, then at least she could have been on the three-on-three -three basketball team. And the turnout would have been a lot different. Here's what people are saying. Someone said, Haley Van Leet isn't good enough to be in the Olympics, man. Someone else said, Haley Van Lee being in the Olympics while Caitlin Clark and Angel Reese are at home is criminal. Someone else said, Haley Van Lee, get that podcast mic ready, champ. <laughs> and it keeps going. 
Someone said, I'm sorry, but how even Haley Van Leet make an Olympic team over Caitlin Clark? She was barbecue chicken in her college career against Caitlin. It's effing three on three basketball. You're telling me Caitlin, Angel, and Enrique win steamroll every country in this? Yeah, I agree with you. Last but not least, someone said the three on three basketball game was painful to watch. That's what the powers that be, USA Basketball, get for not at least having Caitlin Clark on their team instead of Haley Van Leet, who chokes consistently. I don't even know who the other two are, and I'm a women's basketball fan. Laugh out loud. Now, you see, people are upset about Haley Van Leet being on their team, and she is the only college player that's on this three-on-three women's Olympic basketball team. Now, I mean, I don't know what took place and how she got that spot, but people like this picture say, Haley Van Leet isn't her. You can play offense, but you're going to need some defense. And definitely, you know, playing like this game, you're going to need some good offense, but you're going to need to stop people. And that's why people saying Caden Clark should have been on this team. Now, somebody dropped the ball with this, and I feel bad for the coach. You know, it's your first game. You lose 17 to 13 against Germany. And it's, it appears that everybody else on the USA women's team was holding their weight. And Hayden Van Leet just could not keep up. All the stuff online saying Germany just kept going at her, going at her, because they realized it was a weakness over there. And so they took full advantage of it and came away with the W. But y'all get in the comments. Tell me what y'all think about this. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like and share this video, and also hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I drop another video, and also follow my social media at GertieMac15. Holla.